Hi, and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to back up your communication apps. This applies to Apple as well as any Android phone. Uh, the apps I'll be talking about are mainly WhatsApp and Line. The reason is Facebook Messenger and Skype, so long as you remember your password, once you uh, re-enter that information, all your stuff comes back as normal. Uh, but please know any normal backup you do of your phone to your PC or the cloud will not include your line chats or your WhatsApp chats and history and so on. So it's very important you set this up and do it. Uh, I'll make this as simple as I can without going on too long. Oh, and by the way, uh, you, yeah, you, don't look behind you. I notice you're watching this video and you haven't subscribed. It takes a lot of work to put these videos together. So please press the subscribe, <laughs> subscribe button, press the like button. That means other people can find me on Google's analogics, whatever they call it, and send it to your friends. It really would help me enormously. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers. I'm getting close, but not quite there yet. Okay, on with the show, as they say. Let's talk about Lion first, which uh, is the most popular in Asia by far. However, it's also one of the most antiquated apps there are, frankly. The call quality, etc. on WhatsApp is far superior. So let's go to Lion and I'm going to walk you through what you've got to do. Lion, you press the home button, which is at the bottom left, where there's a little picture of a house with me so far. That's the page you should be on. Next, uh, the top right, where you've got what's called the gear icon, which also means settings. Tap on that. Then you're going to go to your account. Um, just to show you, you filled in your email. You've got that all complete and your password. You do need to know that. The other thing you can do with Lion you by ticking the box here it says allow login you can then use uh, the lion account on your pc or your ipad it will not allow you to use it on more than one mobile device to my knowledge don't know why uh, facebook messenger you can use on more than one mobile device i do actually like facebook messenger seems to have a lot of pluses but uh, privacy could be a concern there so once you've done that, we go back and we go to uh, chats. You tap on the chat, you can change your wallpaper. And if you want a more detailed uh, explanation how to use Lion, where you can change wallpapers and do this and that, and et cetera, et cetera, pop up stickers uh, and things, let me know. But in the meantime, you go to backup and restore chat history. Okay, back up and restore chat history at the top. Then you can back up to uh, your Google Drive account. You've got to have that on your setup when you've set up your email account. It's free so long as you keep it within so much of storage, uh, but it doesn't take up much actually. Back up to Google Drive. It's doing it now very fast. That's one good news, and it's just been done. As you can see, that's how much size it is. And I just backed it up on the 25th of April period and it goes to my account. If this was a new phone, um, say I had dropped mine or it's damaged, doesn't work, whatever. You just download Lion, fill in your email account, phone number and your password, press restore and it would all come back as good as new. Now on the newer uh, Android phones, if you do not do this, your contacts will restore automatically, but none of the chats, none of the history, and so on. Uh, on the newer phones, on Android, that is, anyway. Uh, they do not have an option to, that I know about where you can automatically back up and restore your history online, which is terrible, frankly, but that's how it is. Next, we go to WhatsApp, which is a lot easier because it's a one-time setup. Go to WhatsApp. Tap the three dots at the top, go to settings. Obviously, I blurred out my personal information, but you go to your account. And just to let you know, once again on here, you can change the wallpapers and this, that and the other. But you go to your account 
Uh, and here you can actually see some of your information. You can make it much more secure with a two-step verification. Uh, but you go to chats. I've chosen a dark theme. If you're using one of the newer, more expensive phones, uh, I prefer dark or black. Uh, it saves up to 25% of your battery. Very, very useful. Um, here, the other option you've got is media visibility. Automatically, when you open a photograph from WhatsApp, it will automatically store it in your photo gallery if you want to do that. I personally don't need to do that. Uh, or don't want to do it. Font size, you can change things like that. Chat backup. And here is the last time I backed it up. I'm going to press backup now. And as you can see, again, it will only take a few seconds. Again, it's being backed up to Google Drive and it's really fast. Uh, and it should be done about now, which it is. Right now it's done. But what you have an option here, remember your password, but you can back it up once you've set it up every day, once a week, monthly, or manually, or never, up to you. But once you've set it up, you can relax. I've got mine on weekly, that's all I need. And I've also chosen to back up uh, Wi-Fi uh, over Wi-Fi only. No reason to use up my data for backing up. And I've not bothered to include the videos. I don't need those to come back, frankly. Uh, and that's that. So once again, I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you've got any questions. I'm happy to help. And if you want me to teach you how to do a complete backup of your Android phone, especially, let me know. There's a few different methods that apply to any Android phone. Uh, I am amazed even now because, as you know, I do help people restoring new phones, etc., etc. How many people don't remember their passwords and have not done any backup? Uh, and frankly, it's a real nightmare because they're no longer mobile phones. These are computers that we store in our pockets. So please press the like button, press subscribe, and I'll see you soon.